The average price of a home this summer hit $700,000. It's dropped a little bit down. More and more of our residents and our children can't afford to buy a home or rent a home. And they're being forced to move somewhere else. And those who move to Hawaii, who have the money, are buying these more expensive homes. And what does that say for our community? What kind of community are we going to be living in in the future? So we're throwing out a bold, strong, controversial new proposal to try to see if we can't get a different model in place so that we remain a balanced, healthy community where we have housing for every segment of our community and a stronger democracy. And I know the council members here today are passionate about doing that. I don't think we have the silver bullet, but I think we're on the way of coming up with a proposal that I believe will make a difference and provide more affordable rentals and more affordable for sale units. And so we're beginning that journey and we want to continue to work with the public to get their input with all the stakeholders. None of us are so latched into one on one that we're going to fight it no matter what. We're open to adjusting and using our great marketplace. I mean, I think the United States capitalistic system works, but it responds to incentives, responds to regulations within that market, and that's what we're talking about today. So I want to thank each and every one of you for coming. We'll stick around for individual questions. And by the way, this is the beginning of a major dialogue over the next coming months with all of us here today. We want you to be a part of it. Thank you so much.